this lockdown affected you? This is a story about my friends and my colleagues and what it's like for us all to be like connected during the lockdown. My name is Robin Meader. My profession is that I am an artist and draw all these pictures over the lockdown. When I first went back to work, I was really scared about the virus. What a relief, we've got all these products that are on sale to protect us from the coronavirus. <laughs> but there are people who have just walked into the shop and bought the whole entire stall out. When I got home, I got to look after my auntie Jill. Then Uncle Chris phones up and says, Can you cut the fish? I'm going to try Uncle Chris, so what I did, I took the fish out of the freezer, put it straight into the oven for 25 minutes, it was warm but it wasn't cooked properly, so I bung it into the microwave and it was cooked perfectly. I was a bit worried I was going to give Auntie Jill food poisoning. Hey, we joined me some of my friends, because we can't go and meet each other because we're on lockdown but we are talking really well on social media. <laughs> hey look, there's Charlotte, my PA with her dog, Rita. Hi, Robin. How are you? Not bad at the moment. You know, Bugsy was really ill with coronavirus. Oh, no, he wasn't. Yeah, I was so worried about him. He's better now. Oh, brilliant. So, this weekend, we went out for a really nice dog walk. And we saw bluebells, and we heard birds singing. Oh, that is great. Oh, look. Look, it's Clemma. She's popped up. Hi, Clemma. Hi, Clemma. I've just been going around in kind of circles to get used to my bike and enjoying the sun. Brilliant. Can you tell me about your hot tub? <sighs> it's amazing. If it's a bit chilly, it's nice to get in there because it's lovely and hot. And you think, ah. Oh. That sounds great. Are there any people that you've been, like, missing? My mum. Mum and Richard. They live all the way down in Cornwall. My friends on my world. And I miss you, all of you. Me too. Clemma, we, we all miss you too. I know that. <laughs> yeah. Tell me about the cooking you've been doing, the Rice Krispie Cakes. OK, well, all you've got to do is melt up some chocolate in a bowl and put the melted chocolate, the Rice Krispies, into it. And then, when they're cooled down, eat them. Ooh. Hi, Mike. Howdy, partners. Hi, Mike. How are you? Not too bad. Getting there. Been doing some walking in the town. Um, yeah, just mostly walking. Yeah. I'm finding it pretty easy. Are you? Yeah. I'm actually glad that I'm by myself. Yeah. What is the thing you're going to most look forward to doing? Going back to storytellers, going back to drama, meeting up with loads of mates and stream, going to cinemas, doing whatever already. Hello, Tracy. Hello, Alice. Hello. Hello, Alice. How are you? I'm okay. Me and my dad, we've been doing a thousand piece puzzle. It's a Marvel puzzle and it's it's called Impossible Puzzle because it's really complicated to do. Ah. We've been going down to my mum and dad's allotment. They grow in runner beans, there's rhubarb, all sorts. What I miss is having a laugh and talking about anything. With the, with the girls. Yeah. Yeah. Hello, Charlotte. Hello. That's what I made. You made a rainbow. Yeah. This is for the NHS. Amazing. Oh, that's lovely, Charlotte. Yeah. Yeah, I've missed friends and just a bit sad, really. Not being at Open Storytellers. And all the staff at Open Storytellers, too. Me, too. OK. Oh, no, where's Tracy? Do you think her battery ran out? Probably she's asleep with her cat. Yeah. Hey, it's Leslie! 
I haven't seen you for a long time, Leslie. Right, well, I've just bought myself a flat. Oh, brilliant. Well, I'm looking forward to moving into my new house eventually. I want to invite one of my friends, who is, is a very enthusiastic gardener, hoping she'll tell me what all the trees that are growing there are and uh, all the plants. Oh, that's great, Les. I'm glad you got somebody helping you to do the gardening. Elijah's you're standing two metres apart. Yeah, oh, and I made myself a bread and butter pudding yesterday. I love bread and butter pudding. I haven't done it for years, so I didn't know how it would turn out, but that was really nice. Oh, no, we've only got two minutes left. Don't forget, guys, 2 o'clock next Thursday. Bye, see you all then. Yeah, you Goodbye, then. everybody. Bye. Keep Bye. safe. Bye. See you all soon. Bye. Oh, that was good fun talking to all my friends. Well, I better go now and get Jill's tea for tonight. And water the tomatoes in the back garden. Get my work clothes ready for tomorrow. Make myself some pat lunch for work. Do the grocery shopping tomorrow morning. And also some more.